Hey there, welcome back to our channel. Today I wanted to do some affirmations with you for abundance. How I like to do affirmations is I like to focus on one theme for the week and my affirmations for the week surround that theme. This week, I wanted to share some affirmations about abundance. The literal definition of abundance is an ample amount, affluence, wealth, a degree of plentifulness, and when I think of abundance, I think of every single need of mine being met, me having everything that I want and need, and not being scared that I will one day lack something or be without, that I am always living in a space of abundance and that I will never want or need anything in my life because I will always have more than enough. One thing I like to do is back my affirmations up by scriptures. I like to read scriptures based on the affirmations that I speak. I was always taught that sometimes you have to stand on scripture, meaning whatever you may be facing right now in your life, good or bad, sometimes you have to have a scripture that you come back to daily, that you repeat daily, that you meditate on or pray about. And that is how you stand on a scripture. You let it anchor you in whatever season that you are currently in. So today we'll run through some positive affirmations for abundance. You can repeat those affirmations after me and I'll say them twice. Then we will follow those affirmations up by scripture. So thinking about what abundance means to you, what it means for you. Let's begin. I am blessed with an abundance of love, joy, and wealth. I am blessed with an abundance of love, joy, and wealth. I am open to receiving unexpected blessings of abundance. I am open to receiving unexpected blessings of abundance. I allow everything to be as it is. I allow everything to be as it is. I release all limiting beliefs about money and welcome abundance into my life. I release all limiting beliefs about money and welcome abundance into my life. I am worthy of what I desire. I am worthy of what I desire. I am open to receiving unexpected blessings and opportunities. I am open to receiving unexpected blessings and opportunities. I am grateful for the abundance that I have and the abundance that's on its way. I am grateful for the abundance that I have and the abundance that's on its way. As I give in this life, I receive in this life. As I give in this life, I receive in this life. I release any scarcity mentality and embrace the abundance mindset. I release any scarcity mentality and embrace the abundance mindset. What is for me will always be for me. What is for me will always be for me. I attract abundance and prosperity with ease. I attract abundance and prosperity with ease. I am a magnet for abundance, prosperity, and good fortune. I am a magnet for abundance, prosperity, and good fortune. 
I use my gifts, talents, and skills to advance my life and the lives of others. I use my gifts, talents, and skills to advance my life and the lives of others. I am grateful for the money that I have right now. I am grateful for the money that I have right now. I am always moving toward what I want. I am always moving toward what I want. I am wealthy beyond money. I am wealthy beyond money. Now, let's shift and get into some scripture that support these affirmations. John 10, verse 10. The thief does not come except to steal and to kill and to destroy. I have come that they may have life and that they may have it more abundantly. The thief does not come except to steal and to kill and to destroy. I have come that they may have life and that they may have it more abundantly. Psalm 65, verse 11. You crown the year with your goodness and your paths drip with abundance. You crown the year with your goodness and your paths drip with abundance. Philippians 4, verse 19. And my God shall supply all your needs according to his riches in glory by Christ Jesus. And my God shall supply all your needs according to his riches in glory by Christ Jesus. Jeremiah 29, verse 11. For I know the thoughts that I think towards you, says the Lord, thoughts of peace, not evil, to give you a future and a hope. For I know the thoughts that I think towards you, says the Lord, thoughts of peace, not evil, to give you a future and a hope. Matthew 6, verse 33. But seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added to you. But seek first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added to you. Psalm 37, verse 23 and 24. The steps of a good man are ordered by the Lord, and he delights in his way. Though he fall, he shall not be utterly cast down, for the Lord upholds him with his hands. The steps of a good man are ordered by the Lord, and he delights in his way. Though he fall, he shall not be utterly cast down, for the Lord upholds him with his hands. 2 Corinthians 9 verse 8 And God is able to make all grace abound towards you, that you, always having all sufficiency in all things, may have an abundance for every good work. And God is able to make all grace abound towards you, that you, always having all sufficiency in all things, may have an abundance for every good work. Psalm 23, verse 5. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup runs over. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup runs over. Ephesians 3, verse 20. Now to him who is able to do exceedingly, abundantly above all that we ask or think according to the power that works in us. Now to him 
who is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that we ask or think according to the power that works in us. And the last one, Luke 638, give and it will be given to you. Good measure, pressed down, shaken together and running over will be put into your bosom for with the same measure that you use, it will be measured back to you. Give, and it will be given to you. Good measure, pressed down, shaken together, and running over will be put into your bosom. For with the same measure that you use, it will be measured back to you. Thank you so much for tuning in today. Please like this video if you enjoyed today's affirmations and scriptures, and be sure to share it with the people that you love. Also, make sure you're subscribed to this channel for more affirmation videos coming soon. And until next time, peace.